What's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is the L and J Shave Crepe. We're back at it again. As you can see, I'm already pre-shaved, so we're ready to roll. Now, today will be a shave like the one that I did say. It's gonna be the Strike Gold Shave. Kennedy. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> That's a blooper. There you guys go. We got the aftershave and the soap. Cool. Now, I've already got it in my captain's choice. Lathable, copper, okay? And we're gonna be using one of my favorite brushes by Kraken. Today's some, some sort of like a pink theme going on today. So let's get it going. There it is, ladies and gents. I've already used the soap once, but I've used the splash many a times. But I finally found the soap, so I bought it. I bought it at Murphy & McNeil. They're a real good shop. You guys need to check them out. I've got a lot of things to talk to you guys about. And I've also got some footage from the Route 66 shooting range. Had a lot of fun with the homie. He brought his AR and his uh, three pistols and I brought my uh, Springfield XD9. It's another nine millimeter. And we had a lot, a lot of fun that day. It was a uh, Sunday that just passed. Today's Labor Day Monday. We're all off and I'm here about to get shaved going. So far, so good. Oh my goodness, it looks really good. Oh, yeah, yep, can't go wrong with that. Got that wiggle going. Let's see. Getting soap everywhere. <laughs> okay, now let's speak on that shooting range experience that I had. This is my second time going. I feel a lot more uh, comfortable, a lot more stronger. Um, my, uh, what's it called? My, my muscle memory is coming in, so my hands are feeling a lot more comfortable with the weapon. And uh, Kevin, my homie, is a really good teacher on top of that. He's been teaching me a lot about guns and AR-15s because I'm already gonna be building my first one. So that's gonna be awesome. And before I forget, before I continue that story, we're gonna be using the Phoenix Artist and Accoutrements Ascension Razor. Double open comb with an asterisk. And I bought these on Amazon. This is a whole pack of like, like I wanna say like a hundred? I don't know. <laughs> so let's get for it, let's get to it. Well, I've always liked the Ascension as it cuts through my hair easily. The um, Astro Blade I'm using is amazing as well. Anyway, back to the story. So I got some video I will be inputting into this shave so you guys can see the shooting range video on top of the shave. I had a lot of fun. Um, I have never been to Route 66. The shooting range, I, I, this is only my second time going to a shooting range. The first one was La Puente shooting range. And, and uh, that was really fun too. I got to shoot um, my homie Kevin's um, shotgun. That thing was long and it was awesome. The first was like a little bit of a shock because I've never shot one before and it was awesome. The second one on the video, you, you can hear it. I, I ding that target. It was like ding because I hit it. <laughs> well, that was fun. But Kevin was killing it with my gun. He was nailing all the targets with my, with my XD9. Yeah. He's a good shooter. He really is. I still need a lot of practice, but it's a brand new hobby to me. I only got two months into it. So I'm brand new at, at shooting guns and going to ranges. Lucy will be buying her Glock 19 coming soon so we can all go have a family shooting range day, you know? 
family and friends. Everybody welcome, you know? And if you guys don't notice, right here and right here, Lucy helped me shave my hair. Not all of it, just the sides here. And we got a ducktail going, which I'll show you towards the end of the video. Okay. Uh, Lucy's a real badass when it comes to using the safety razor. She's really good at it. I don't know if I've already told you guys, but she's the one who got me started on it. And she was the one first safety razoring my face. I, I I wasn't even the first one to do my own face. She did, because I was too scared of it. Eventually, I got used to it, and now you guys see me on camera. So, like I said, I'll be inputting some uh, video footage of the Route 66 shooting range day that we had on Sunday, and you guys can see the, all the fun and the loadout that we had. It was freaking dope. It was awesome. And um, apparently, there was an earthquake the day before. Babe, was it the day before? The earthquake or was it Friday? Uh, I want to say it was Friday. Well, there was an earthquake on Friday of like a 3.5 magnitude or something. And I can only imagine it's because of the heat, you know? So that's what happened then too. Um, oh, and then we came back from the shooting range. And I started making the carne asada and then the, the homie Kevin took over and luckily he did because his cooking skills are out of control. And he explained to me the proper way to eat carne asada because I did not know there was a specific way. But that explains why I would choke a lot. <laughs> so apparently you gotta cut the, the pieces in against the grain. I'll further explain that later on, but if you guys know what I'm talking about, try it. It's also less to chew through and that's very true. Oh yeah, look at that, ladies and gents. This uh, strike gold stuff is amazing. It smells delicious. It smells cologne, which is something one of my favorites. A little quiet because I want to get the shave through and I don't want to cut myself again. And uh, It's <laughs> my kid in the background. Wow, no kidding. This Astro Blade kicks ass. And there it is, ladies and gents. This has been the Strike Gold Shave. We're gonna do the aftershave up. I will not forget, so I'll be right back. And we're back, ready for that aftershave. Let me just use this Lancaster Razorworks shave towel, which I'm waiting for more, brother, when you're ready to drop them. <laughs> Let's see here. Okay. Oh, dude, that soap is amazing. It's in my tongue. That's all right, I'll get that after. Okay, let's hang this back up. Let's get that aftershave. Strike Gold Kennedy. Had a lot of fun this Labor Day weekend. Also had enough time to sleep in because I worked really early hours. Oh, there's a serious burn all right. Damn, babe. Woo. Wow. Okay. And there it is, ladies and gents, the Strike Gold Shave. I got these products from Murphy and McNeil, and I think I got some of them from actually the Strike Gold website. And uh, here's the shave bolt and shave brush. It's really good. The lather's amazing. Okay, and then the, we're gonna I'll show you guys the 
razor one more time. I bought this a long time ago, maybe a year ago. And this thing's a killer every time. That double open home and that Astro Blade. Freaking awesome. And let's not forget, I can't live without this. The Shave Soap Scooper by Smiles for Miles. Now, ah, oh, before I forget, I did use the pre-shave for also, I always use the blue. There it is. And that's all thanks to Soap Thing. That's the name of the channel, Soap Thing. That guy is awesome to watch him. All right. I want to thank you guys for watching. And as you can see in the background, where is it? Route 66 Shooting Sports Park. This is my target, and this is the work that I was trying to put in. But I got, as you can see, I got a lot of flyers over here. But I did a good couple kill shots right there, right here, right here, and in the body. Definitely in the body. I did get to shoot that AR-15, and you'll see that in the video. Dude, that thing was awesome, all right? I recommend anybody, if you guys are interested in getting into the hobby, um, I think I'll recommend, um, if you guys are from the San Bernardino area, to check out Red Star Armory. This is their logo. Hopefully you guys can see the the IG. Nope. Okay, we'll go to the back. Red Star Armory. And then their uh, IG is red.star.armory. Okay? If you want to go for your first weapon or your second weapon, these guys are awesome. So I definitely recommend Red Star Armory. And then I also recommend Golden State Armory. They're located in Azusa, I believe. Um, I don't recommend Turners too much, but I mean, if you want to try them, go for it. And Bass Pro Shops, they're cheap in, uh, as far as ammo pricing goes, but they're very, very anal when it comes to all your identification. Everything has to match. You've got to have a multitude of identifications to buy ammo and whatever, what have you. It's just a bigger chain, so they're a lot more anal about it. But Turner's, uh, Red Star Armory, and um, Golden State Armory, they're really cool with you, especially Red Star. Um, they really get down and talk to you and show you all their products. It's really great. It's a great experience. So if you guys are interested in getting into the hobby, check them out. And because uh, I thank you guys for watching. This has been the LNJ Shave Crave, and we'll get back to it again on the next one. Happy Labor Day. Peace out. We're about to use the uh, AR-15, the Brothers AR. It's pretty sick. We're about to get down with that.